Hello, it's Pinky from Maiden Chelsea and welcome back to Pinky's Boutique. Red lips are great for the season and never go out of fashion. So this week I'm going to show you how to perfect a classic red lip. It's really important when you do a red lip to have a flawless face. So that's why I've got this Vichy uh, Dimmer Blend foundation. It's a really high coverage foundation. I've actually already applied my foundation. This is the one I used. I can show you on my hand though. Show you that it's quite thick and it's good at covering any blemishes you might have. This is a uh, concealer from Too Faced called Absolutely Flawless. Um, you can use this under your eyes to get any dark circles away, but also if you have still got some blemishes, this will completely cover them. It does what exactly it says, um, it does give you a completely flawless finish. I've got a red MAC lip pencil in the colour Cherry. So I'm going to go around my lip line with this pencil, holding my lip taut so I can get a really nice defined line without messing it up too much. Once you've got the line perfect, then fill in your lips with the liner. So now I've applied the uh, lip liner to the lips. This is a very good base for putting the lipstick on top. So keep everything in place and looking rich. There's lots of different red lipsticks you can get. Some with warm orange undertones and some with blue undertones. Blue undertones work really well for all skin types, even pale skin types. I'm going to go for a lipstick with blue undertones. This is the Clarins Rouge Eclat colour. It's very red. Using a brush, using both sides of the brush, apply it into the middle of the lip first. Kind of glossy. Makes it feel moisturised. It smells really good as well. It's a good idea to use a lip brush because you get the colour exactly where you want it to go. It's going to blot the tissue. Next up, I'm using a Daniel Sandler um, powder, and it's called Invisible Veal Powder. I'm going to just quickly turn it upside down and use what's left in the lid with my brush. A really good trick to make your lipstick last all night and longer is to brush this translucent powder all over your lips. So now I'm going to apply the same lipstick again to layer it up on the lips and give it that glossy kind of moisturised look, look at the same time. We're going to blot again and then finally apply the lipstick one more time. To make your lipstick filler, I'm going to be using this intense red lip gloss from Nukes in the centre of my lip, dabbing it on. Next up, using this Clarins Complexion Perfector on my cheekbones. You don't want to use a bronzer because it'll take the attention away from the lips. So just dabbing this under the eyes, on cheekbones. You wouldn't want to use a blush with a red lip because it'd be too much red going on. It's quite sheer in highlighting, so it works really well. I hope you like my tips and tricks of getting my classic red lip look. If you do, then give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. All of the products will be in the description box below, but you can also get them on essential.com. Stay tuned because I'll be back next week. Bye.